no flips, just reviews. For today I have from Mattel's WWE Target exclusive NXT TakeOver Elite line. He is Scott Dawson. And he debuted on NXT March 7th, 2013. And he is Dash Wilder. And he debuted July 17th, one day after my birthday, 2014, on NXT. But together, they are collectively known as The Revival. And they both come with a NXT Tag Team Championship. But before I get each member of The Revival out of their respective packaging, let's take a closer look at both at the same time. So here's Scott Dawson in the packaging. There's that Tag Team Championship. There's Dash Wilder in his packaging with his NXT Tag Team Championship. Here are the sides of both packages. And here's the back. Here's Dash Wilder's profile. And apparently he's doing his best imitation of the rock by doing the people's eyebrow and here there's you get in the line and here's Scott Dawson and his profile and there he is looking like one mean tough son of a gun so now without further ado let's get the revival out by not using flips but fists and here is Scott Dawson and Dash Wilder out of their elite Packagings. Speaking of their elite packagings, it's too bad you don't get to see this while the figure is inside. But after you take the figure out, you can actually see the Revival logo in the background of the box. It's too bad they don't make it more prominent when they're inside the box. But oh well. Before I take a closer look at each figure, let's take a closer look at those sweet looking tag team championship titles. And here are those NXT tag team championship titles. Now this isn't the first time we've gotten them, but this is the first time I've gotten them. Now I have all of the NXT championship titles. Unfortunately, they are all outdated. To quote my good friend, Ebenezer Milstorf, what a waste! But in this case, when they were tag team champions back in NXT, they did have these. So, yeah. So now without further ado, let's take a closer look at each member. Let's start with Scott Dawson. Here is his face, and he's about ready to punch you in the face with his fist. Because no flips, just fists. And he is bald-headed, and he's got that really awesome facial hair, like a tough guy would have. Go down to his trunks, which have his initials. And on the back of his butt, it says, The Revival. He has two knee pads. One of them has the no flips, just fists mantra of The Revival. He's got white boots with red flames. Nice. Oh, and he has black wrist tape on this wrist, white wrist tape. Also, his hand is wrapped in white, and he's got one elbow pad that says the mantra for the revival. Now, let's take a closer look at Dash Wilder. Here is his face. There's his chest hair. He's got a tattoo right here. I think that's... Japanese for no flips, just fists. He's got a tattoo, what looks like a snowflake on his shoulder blade right here. Not only does he have this wrist taped in black, he does here too, but his hand is also wrapped. If we go down to his trunks, there's his initials, revival on his butt. The knee pads match the trunks, but his boots are black with these gold rectangles on them. Nice. And his boots have white soles. But that is it for my review of the revival from the NXT TakeOver Elite Series. That's exclusive only to Target. Tell me what you guys think. And which is your favorite member of the revival? Is it Scott Dawson 
or is it Dash Wilder? Let me know in the comments below. But until the next review, I will see you soon. And just like I said at the beginning of the video, when it comes to my videos, no flips, just reviews.